eyes. I kind of want to dye my hair dark blue. People keep sending me pictures with dark blue hair. I'm digging it. Oh yeah, silver. Hey guys, I am here today with a... I totally forgot what video I'm filming. Crap. <laughs> I'm here today with a stationery haul and how to reorganise your desk because I did one of these quite a while ago and my desk is just boring me a little bit right now so I would bought a few new things and I thought I would show you what they are. So the first two things I bought are notebooks because obviously if you're sat at a desk you might want to write some notes and I got this blue one and I also got this coral one and they just look so bright and fun and obviously it's coming up to spring and summer now so I thought I would get bright fun colours and they can just sit on my desk. Everything in this video is from Tiger by the way but this is not sponsored, I just really like that shop and it's so cheap for stuff like this. The next thing that I got is so cute, it's a moustache pencil and I just think that this will look really cute on your desk. I've basically gone for a black and white theme with pops of like gold and some colour but I will show you that later but for now I just got this pencil, so cute! Next up I got two of these elastic band balls and I've never owned one of these but I always need elastic bands, I just wish they kind of came in cuter colours because these are a bit boring like pink and mint and baby blue and stuff, that'd be cuter. But anyway, I just got some elastic band balls. You never know when you're going to need an elastic band, do you? I also got this pot going along with the black and white theme and it is this. It's just got little triangles on and they're black and white obviously and I'm going to be standing some pens or something or other in this. I then got some giant pins just because I always like to pin stuff together. So I thought I would get some giant ones because they are so cute. And I got this little pot thing, obviously also from Tiger, but it's just three little cups that are glued together and you could totally do this as a DIY and just find three cups and glue them together yourself. But I just thought this was so cute and I think it was like six pounds, so I thought that I would buy it. Reminds me of Alice in Wonderland, so cute. I then got some tape because I am constantly taping things. I use my desk a lot to scrapbook when I'm not using it for editing and I use Use this tape for scrapbooking it's so good just a little tip it's two for a pound at Tiger and you get two rolls and you can buy a little dispenser for it to cut them and it's just so much easier than using a big roll of sellotape. I also got this whiteboard and it's in the shape of a page and I think this is so cool it comes with a pen and yeah I'm just gonna stand this up and write anything that I need to remember on it and it's so good because then you can just rub it off whenever you are done with it and it's not like you have to throw away little pads of paper that you've scribbled all over so it's better for the environment yay <laughs> I also got a bin for underneath my desk because damn I've needed a bin for so long so I got this one it goes like in and out in a pattern I just think it's cute and it was super cheap so that is just gonna sit underneath my desk that is the end of the little haul. I obviously didn't want to buy too much because I still do have a lot of things on my desk but I'm going to show you more now how I reorganise everything and how I would do that for spring and summer or just a general tidy really because I think my desk needs it. So if you want to see that, carry on watching.
end of my stationery haul and desk organisation video. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and subscribe if you'd like to see more and I'll see you in my next one. Bye guys! I wanted to and I do want to but I thought that I would have a year here and then move after the year so I'm going to move in September instead. Anyway so